us. And now the station arm is ungrappled and it's moving away. At this point, uh, we're configuring the station robotic arm for its trip back from work site three, back to work site eight. Um, and the, uh, the OBSS is grappled by, this, by the shuttle robotic arm and it's gonna stay in a nice warm th thermal environment overnight. And here's a nice shot of the mobile transport on its way back to work site eight. And then finally, a, a beautiful panorama of the configuration as the crew left it tonight. You can see the shuttle robotic arm grappled to the OBSS, which kind of goes across the top of your picture. Off to the left, you can see the mobile transporter at Worksite 8 with the station arm uh, powered up and ready to go. This will be the configuration overnight, and you can see the, uh, the 4B solar array in the far left-hand side of your picture there. The plan in the morning will be to maneuver the OBSS to a handoff position. Uh, the station arm grapples it at Worksite 8. And, uh, and then we go to work uh, getting Parazansky onto the arm and then out to the work site. We've also got another uh, graphical representation uh, of what we expect the EVA day to look like. We could go to that. And this is, this is uh, the station robotic arm holding the OBSS. And you can see uh, Parazinski has already uh, uh, ingress the OBSS. He's on the uh, the very tip there, taking what is has got to be a fabulous ride on his way to the 4B solar array. And one of the challenges we have here is is maneuvering uh, the the robotic arm and the OBSS past past the P3 P4 solar arrays, which of course we're going to have parked for this for this activity. And one of the things that we're going to ask. Uh, Doug Wheelock to do, who's going to be EVA2 on the, on the spacewalk, is to, is to help the crew, both the crew and the ground, with clearances as we maneuver uh, past the P3, P4 solar rays. Another thing you can, you can see here is that uh, we're, we're reaching basically the, we're using the entire length of the station robotic arm and, and the addition of the OBSS to get Scott where we need him to be in order to uh, assess the tear and do the repair. So uh, the way the day went today, uh, when, when the crew woke up, uh, we had a draft set of procedures on board. We had a draft EVA timeline, and we had a draft set of robotic procedures. Uh, the crew spent the morning reviewing and studying those procedures. Uh, we had a, a tag up with the spacewalking crew uh, in the morning before lunch. Uh, around lunchtime, while they were taking their break, we uplinked a, a final set of EVA proce procedures and uh, a few um, minor updates to the robotic procedures in the